Welcome back to Fire Emblem Three Houses. Um, before we start the main campaign, I'm gonna show you what hap what basically what happens if you uh recruit female, if you have female pilot as the player character. Um, as the version of pilot you're playing as. All oh, right, yeah, I'm in this battle. So Sylvain here. All right, so I'm gonna do this battle using female pilot. We've already seen all this. I'm Every so often, I'm going to show you the progress of Female Pilot. Female Pilot is actually going to add support with Claude here in the future. Let's get to it. I'm going to have Lawrence there. Ready and willing. Claude here. Stay focused. Come me. And let people level up. Anytime. Leave it to me. Let's sit here here like to be a new. I got this. Who, me? And some of them. Alright, yeah. Right. I'm going to have Claude here, Night uh, take on that guy. Sorry, but victory is mine. Claude is now level 20, is now level 5. We were taken by surprise. Female pilot is to now take down those bandits. Female pilot is slightly different than male pilot. Another step forward. And she's also getting stats screwed. Ignots move up a bit. Oh boy. Yeah, you could now use physics. <laughs> Lauren's best. Leave it to me. Stay focused. I stand ready. Let's use Tempest then. Ready anytime. Who, me? I got this. Oh boy. Ready and willing. No, I'm don't. Sorry. Okay, wow. Okay, Maria is now level 3 because she healed Please. herself a little. Please forgive me. No! And that 
is why you don't need the healer in range. Stay focused. <laughs> As expected. Leave it to me. All right, let's sit here. I'm gonna have you take this dude down. Precious I'll manage. Tweet it, tweet it, tweet it. Oh, yes. Down. This is what I Yay, I can now physic. I stand ready. Heal. Ready anytime. I got this. Who, me? Ready and willing. Alright, the Marianne is now uh, level 3. Yeah, let's use a bit. Let's use your vulnerary. What use is your vulnerary? Think about pilots moving up. Gotta let everyone move up a bit. Oh, I'm at the square. Oh, hey, um, yeah, let's, um, oh, let's hit the can heal. Alright, ignore. I'm gonna go home. How good you hit. Ah. What? I was playing it. I swear, everyone on FEMA pilot. Right, right now, he's getting stat screwed. That's not a good thing. We stole this treasure. It's all ours. There's no way we're gonna give it up to some knights. Alright. 
this heat. We don't want the healer in our range of anyone. Tempest Dance. That's the It is a noble. All right. He's physic on Raphael. <laughs> Gotta let Raph here take some hit. Technically, we we'll each have a healer. Range unit. Hold on, I'll send it not this one. Marianne is going this way with this team. Get a large bullion. Alright, now we can start going down this way.
dare these brats! Yeah, I can't stand you either, Costas. However... I mean, all you're doing is getting Hilda down here. I knew that's where you'd go. We did, we did, yes! I couldn't see it work! Hell, that now that was pretty, now that was four on this road, and... I really am getting um stat screwed on this uh, on this in this on this version of the character. Get stat screwed it off and um I don't think you can win this game if we get stat screwed enough. I don't think you can even complete this game if you get stat screwed hard enough. <laughs> Alright, Lauren can use magic now. Can use magic as well, okay. Hold on. Well, at least you leveled something good up. Alright, that's it. And Greenhead, Lord. Yes! Uh, I should have never listened to that idiot. Claude is now a level 6 noble. Those thieves ran out of luck when your leadership was. Yeah, well. Lysithia's motivation was maxed out. Every so often I'm gonna show female um, pilot progress. Hopefully we don't continue to, to get um, stats screwed. Because I know Both versions, both versions of Pilot are pretty much interchangeable.
Alright, so... That's... Oh my gosh. All right, and grid over here. Now where's Petra? Why? I haven't got Petra yet. All right. I went the wrong way. Fighting to stop a murder? I am spending my days with I am feeling that the way you isn't possible to be switching to your class. I have so much gratitude. I am still without still not used to the speak, but I have full comprehension. Petra has joined the Golden Deer. No classes on Hey Professor. I feel like, is there some reason? What's up, Professor? Hey. Charisma and reason. Hello. Go ahead and keep... Up. Oh. Anyway. Huh, maybe I can recruit Sarah now. I think I gotta wait until after I foil this assassination to recruit him. After the assassination gets spoiled, that we're able to recruit him.
I have an idea. If you're looking for something, try less aimless marketing. Do you even know it's none of my business? Eat plus in bows. Practice yields results. I think Hanuman can teach me how to use bows. I'm not sure. You bet. All right, I can't regret her because I'm not high enough level yet. Goals. We have Ingrid. We were gonna get to become a Pegasus rider. Pegasus Knight. Once he's high enough of a level. We have Lindhart, who's currently at the plus in the Now, we have Petra who I want to teach reason magic to. Alright, so what do you? Let's teach you a bit of authority. That you did better that time. I'm getting it. That was talented. May I be asking a question? Sure. Professor level up! Yay! More activity points and more monthly expenditures. Lawrence wants to speak to me. I'll get a C support. Uh, The plane day. Learning these things gives me great difficulty. Uh, difficulty. I may sound terrible, but you won't notice when everyone else sings too. Heh. <laughs> I'm beginning to understand. 
you guess I'm so It's fun when you defeat It's starting. How is this? Seems simple. It's starting to. I worked to. I've actually decided I'm gonna skip, um... Support when I get to them. Yay! I'm a few of these people in my house now. Let's do some battles. I'm going to do some battles, take a break, do some battles. Um, basically grind levels up to a good enough point. So yeah, so the screen will look different when we get back. And I'm back from grinding. Anyway, now I'm going to do a seminar on using bows. Yes. Nice. I still have much to learn. I think it's coming along. Oh yeah. yeah. Not as hard as I thought. I will master this. Well, I guess I could plant some flowers for his birthday. Yeah, I give you that. Right. I sit here and I'll do 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 Not a you. No way. Give you a steel sword. And now we do this mission. Assault at the right of rebirth. Well. The goddess right of rebirth. The right of rebirth is finally underway. Time to see if our hunch was right. Uh, I hope it's not. Then we wouldn't have to fight anyone. We've all come to this conclusion together. I'm sure we've got it right. Right or wrong, the clock is ticking. All we can do for now is stick to the plan. Stick to the plan! You seem a mite too relaxed for my liking. The goddess's right of rebirth is about to begin. While we are in the goddess tower, 
We are relying on you to secure the locations that are lacking in defense. May I let you in on something, Professor? My brother can be a bit... callous. <laughs> he told me that he was concerned about you, and hinted that perhaps you would be better off patrolling the coffin. <laughs> that was said in jest, Flame, and in confidence. Please just remain by my side and do not cause any more trouble. Ah, oh, man. As a professor, you would do well to remember that it is your duty to guide your students down the path of righteousness. Please excuse us, everyone. We shall see you again after the ceremony has concluded. Ha ha ha. Said it is way too overprotective. It reminds me of my brother. Come on, Teach. I know a hidden spot where we can monitor the stairs that lead to the Holy Mausoleum. Oh. If there's anyone down there, they'll be trapped like the rats they are. We'll just have to take them down without getting bitten. Back to the subject at hand. What I found last night was a sealed coffin in the underground Holy Mausoleum. I did some research, and the only time you can easily get in and out of that place is during the rite of rebirth. Oh. And because of that alleged assassination plot, it has even thinner defenses than usual. It's all too clear. Right. This being Fire Emblem, guess what? Our hunt is right. Alright, who do I want to bring along? Patrick, good, you're good. I don't. Maybe a couple of mages. I don't know what. Let's bring in Ferdinand. Marcus, those central church dusters are Whoops. swatting us. Buy me some. Our guest was spot on. Looks like we have company. Those central church dusters have spotted us. Buy me some time while I open the seal on the casket. I'm on. I'm on. Looks like the enemy is going after the casket in the back. Maybe they're going after the saint's bones? Weird. I'd like to defeat them before they can finish the job. Pretty bad Look closely at the ground. There's some kind of contraption on certain parts of the floor. The smart move is to advance while finding the best fighting positions we can, based on the enemy's weapon. Alright. Let's Yes, thank you there, man. Stay focused. Ready and willing. Don't hold this against me, okay? That's the golden deer for you. Just like that. I will get the victory. A good Petra! Witness, Bridget Pride. Duke Scythia, as I like to call her. Ready any time. I am Ferdinand von Auer. Death Knight, prove your strength and scatter these fools. I do. I'm getting a really disturbing vibe from that guy. No one go near the evil looking knight, okay? I don't take commands. Or waste my time on Okay, there. Any 
archers over here? Yes. Over this way. Let me see. No, there are any. Ready. So yeah, I could send her over this way. I will get the victory. Hi. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. Let's end our one of our healing. I got this. Ready and willing. Ready anytime. Park. Oi. Flame Spirit protect me. Right. Oh, you missed. Good. Yeah, no, we're not sending Luke City up. Leave it to me. <laughs> Must be awful losing to me. I got this. <laughs> nice. Still got room to grow. That was actually a decent level up, Raph. Stay focused. Each battle, a chance to grow. Ready and willing. Um, no! Never underestimate an outsider. Ready anytime. Boy. Wait a minute. I will get the victory. Petra is a thief. I am Ferdinand von Iron. And I mean that in the good sense of the word. In the in a good sense of the word. That's what class she is in this game. Oh, yeah, let's see a Ferdinand over oh, this way. My moment has a Sorry. The victory is mine. Oh, hey. There's a reason I call Lysithia here. Nuke Scythia. If they approach from behind, we can attack them from both sides. I mean, you could try. <laughs> That's the golden deer for you. Meanwhile, Claude being Claude over here.
Sarah. Death Knight's too powerful to take on. Leveled up to level 15. I'm not done yet. I know you're not. Good job, man. D3. Intermediate seal. We don't have anyone you can use that to steer that. Meanwhile, I'm gonna send you over this way. I did what I had to. My technique could use some polish. Is Bridget Pride. Oh. Big glowy sword. Ah, man. 
Ah, man. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Play Dr. Mask, eh? Well... The sword is... I see... What a pleasant surprise! The jerk got away. Was that magic? We can't even chase after him. Any professor, the way that sword is shining, do you think it could be... Is the intruder here? Oh. Looks like you have this under control. Yes, we do, Captain. Round up any stragglers. Will do. As all of you have committed a breach of faith, the Archbishop will now pass judgment. Inciting a kingdom noble to rebel. Unlawful entry. The attempted assassination of the Archbishop. An attack on the Holy Mausoleum. It is unnecessary to go on, followers of the Western Church. What? We have nothing to do with the Western Church. You have already been identified. Please spare us your second-rate theater. Western Church. Dishonoring a holy ceremony is worthy of death for a member of the church. You are well past the hope of redemption. If you have any grace remaining, you will willingly offer your life as atonement for this crime. No, this isn't what we were told would happen. We've been deceived! It's no use arguing. Whatever your excuse, the punishment stands. May your souls find peace as they return to the Goddess. Wait! Please! The Goddess would never forgive you for our execution! Monster! We know you've already slaughtered many of our fellow brethren like this. This concludes the investigation. Please remove these poor lost souls from our sight. God doesn't take that! What was that's that? The assassination attempt, the attack on the Holy Mausoleum. Looks like it was all a plot by the Western Church. It's just too bad that that masked knight who was leading the attack got away. Vanished without a trace. But why would the Western Church want to attack Lady Rhea? Why? Take your pick of reasons. Relations with the Western Church aren't exactly friendly. Oh, that's right. Gerald mentioned that you grew up completely isolated from the Church. The Church of Seros is split into a few different branches across Fodlan. The Central Church is headquartered right here at Garrick Mach. Then there's the Western Church. Far west from Castle Gaspar, where Lord Lanato had his little rebellion, is the fortress city of Arian Road. It's the strongest fortress in the kingdom. On the other side of it is the headquarters of the Western Church. Not too smart to bicker with people who worship the same goddess as you. The bishop of the Western Church must be pretty ambitious. Probably hopes to split off completely. In which case, he'd need to weaken the Central Church's influence. Killing Rhea is certainly one way to do that. To the shock of no one, I hear the Knights have been sent to subdue the leaders of the Western Church. We'll probably get a chance to assist. Hmm. You're an odd one, aren't you, Professor? How'd you make it this far in life without ever interacting with the church? I can't believe someone like you exists in Fodlin. It's too strange. Hey. If you think that's weird, consider the fact that Rhea hired Teach despite all that. So those guys they caught, they all got the axe, right? That's brutal. Lady Rhea can be rather intimidating at times. In fact, Downright terrifying. I agree. Yes, Those who cannot be saved must be delivered to the goddess for judgment. Is that not so? There you are, Professor. 
It seems Lady Rhea would like a word with you. Come with me. The Archbishop lives. Oh. Not that I had ever placed much faith in those swine from the Western Church. I have news, both good and bad. The remains of Saros were not in the tomb. However, something else was. The Sword of the Creator. Ah, the weapon wielded by that thief, the King of Liberation. Thief? Huh. At any rate, it is now in the hands of the Academy's new professor. I doubt you will be surprised to hear that the Crest Stone had already been removed from the sword when it was found. Hmm. As expected. It would be foolish to keep both in the same location. There's more. The Professor was able to awaken the sword's true power. Even without the Crest Stone, the sword glowed red. The Professor's crest is impalpable. There is no mistaking it. Absurd. Using a relic without its crest stone should be impossible. The King of Liberation's bloodline should not even... They must be allowed to keep it, for now. I do not have enough information about the Professor to act. As for your request, I accept. The Death Knight is at your command. Use him well. Good. I believe I will enjoy this a great deal. I cannot thank you enough for defeating those invaders in the Holy Mausoleum, and especially for protecting the Sword of the Creator. That sword is one of the hero's relics, and the most precious artifact in the Church's possession. It is also a weapon of terrifying power. For now, I will entrust the sword to you. Please, use it wisely. I will. Wait, wait, do you truly mean to give the sword of the Creator to this... Stranger, surely it is not the sort of thing one hands over so readily, even to someone who has the ability to wield it. If someone like Nemesis were to appear again, all of Volven would be consumed by war. Nemesis, the king of liberation. He is an ancient king of mankind who was defeated by Seros over a thousand years ago. When Fodlin was attacked by wicked gods, it is said that the goddess gifted Nemesis with the Sword of the Creator. Nemesis used that sword to defeat the wicked gods, saving all of Fodlin. Henceforth, he was dubbed the King of Liberation. However, his power began to corrupt him until he himself turned to the darkness. Saint Seros was forced to destroy him. Lady Rhea, I beg you to reconsider. Given a little more time, we could more accurately assess this stranger's abilities. No. I have faith, Seth. Faith that our friend here will not be corrupted by wickedness. Since the death of Nemesis, none have been able to wield the Sword of the Creator. Now, after all those long years of being sealed away, it has returned and found a new master. I understand. As you wish, Lady Rhea. There you have it, Professor. See that you do not betray the trust the Archbishop has seen fit to bestow upon you. The Sword of right. the Creator? The King of Liberation? Each tale is more confusing than the last. And I really can't read that Rhea at all. That sword is clearly precious. So why is she so keen to gift the thing to you? I feel as though we have become entangled in a mystery. We have! So there is one more thing that has been plaguing me. The Sword of the Creator. It somehow feels distinct from other relics we have seen. Such as the one that... Oh goodness, what was her name? Had... Cat... Yes, her! The Sword of the Creator is different from her Thunderbrand in one key way. It bears a hole, huh. where something should have been, but is no more. I despise not knowing what is going on. It, it, it frightens me. And yet, I place my trust in you. I must. Whatever comes to pass, please swear to cut a path that is your own. I will. The sword of the Creator. 
pulled right from the legends. I finally found it, and yet it ended up in Teach's hands. Could I even use it anyway? Damn it. There's no telling what's to come. Right. I mean... Claude's a schemer, but he's not evil. New month, Aren't verdant rain moon. White clouds, verdant rain moon. Tower, Tower of black, black winds. winds. The ceaseless rains that satiate the verdant landscape of Fodlan are accompanied by fierce winds and mighty roars of thunder. This abundance of rain, sparkling as it falls against beams of emerging sunlight, is a constant reminder to the people of Vodla that nature is ever wild and unpredictable. For when the rain finally does take laws, the clouds part and give way to a glorious rainbow. I mean, I make friends. Need places to explore for that gold. I have a new mission for you, Professor. I would hmm. like for you to take your students into Kingdom territory to eliminate some thieves. They stole a hero's relic from House Gautier of the Holy Kingdom of Vargas. The lands of ruin. Their leader's name is Miklan. He is apparently a disowned son of House Gautier. Ouch. I believe it had something to do with his lack of a crest. Such happenings are fairly common within the kingdom. Wow. Alrighty. The crestless cannot unleash the goddess's power even if they possess a relic. Nonetheless, they are still capable of simply wielding them. Heroes relics are immensely powerful weapons. We must meet this threat with adequate force. Unfortunately, most of the Knights of Seros are away from the monastery, purging the apostates of the Western Church. So we are entrusting you with this mission. After all, you wield the Sword of the Creator, which is more than capable of opposing any relic. The Sword of the Creator is a powerful weapon well beyond the other relics. You have nothing to fear. <laughs> For now, at least. However, to ensure that no harm comes to the students, we will also send the monastery's most skilled individuals to aid you. I must remind you that you are expected to conduct yourself in a manner befitting the heel of that holy sword. Also, you should know that Professor Hanneman has been looking for you. That is all. Oh. Hey, Teach. I gotta say, I never would have guessed you were a descendant of the King of Liberation. You didn't forget, did you? That story I told you about a relic that could cut a mountain in half? That relic was the Sword of the Creator. The very same used by Nemesis, the King of Liberation. Don't be coy, Teach. The Sword of the Creator could only be wielded by Nemesis. If you can use it too, that can only mean you have that bloodline's crest. Ah. Fine. Keep your secrets. But just so you know, I don't understand is it going to cut it here at the monastery. Speaking of, Professor Hanneman has been looking for you. Yeah, I know. He probably wants to examine your crest with those crazy instruments of his. Actually, sounds amusing. Maybe I'll tag along. If it isn't my little Claude, what has you so worked up? Judith, what are you doing here? That's Lady Judith to you, boy. I told you. Until you're in charge, I expect you to address me with all due respect. Anyway, I'm here to retrieve you. Do greet it. Are you saying the old man's on his deathbed? Anyway, I'm here to retrieve you. Duke Regan's condition has taken a turn for the worse. Are you saying the old man's on his deathbed? No, it's not that bad. But in the state he's in, he won't be able to participate in the next roundtable conference. He wants you to go in his stead. 
I volunteered to play the messenger. Well, thanks for that. Oh, and uh, Teach, this is Judith, also known as the hero of House Daphnel. Yeah. <laughs> so you're Little Claude's teacher, are you? How much trouble have you been giving him? If her nickname didn't give it away, you should know that Judith, uh, Lady Judith, is the leader of the famous House Daphnel of the Leicester Alliance. She used to be a big deal at the roundtable conferences, but it seems of late she's been reduced to a mere... You had better shut that mouth before I put my boot in it, you tactless nuisance. Now come on, let's get going. Sorry, Professor, but I need to borrow the boy for a bit. See you, mate. I suppose we'll have to finish our chat later. Huh. Sorry, Teach. But don't you worry. I'll be back in time for our next mission. All right, Judith. Let's get going. It's Lady... Uh, I suppose you are the active leader for the time being. Fair enough, boy. Fair enough. Good of you to come, Professor. I've heard much about you lately. Specifically, that you are able to awaken the sword of the Creator's power. Thusly, it seems the true nature of your crest has been uncovered. I had, of course, seen your crest before. However, at first, I failed to recognize its true nature. Eventually, it dawned on me that what is visible is perhaps merely a small part of a greater whole. Ah. In other words, your crest is too significant to be detected when using normal instruments. After this discovery, I began researching crests that might fit that description which allowed for a temporary hypothesis. However, I could not be certain. The crest my conclusions led me to was far too unusual. A crest thought to have disappeared from this world in the millennium since the fall of Nemesis, the King of Liberation. A crest of flames. That is what you possess. Hmm. Your ability to wield the sword of the Creator has unequivocally proven my hypothesis. A legendary power, dormant since time immemorial, and now resurrected. There can be no doubt that this ancient power resides within you. Ah. Ah, it's been my birthday. Okay, let me to explore. I'll do some grinding here. And, yeah. Exploration there. Alright, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to save here. That's going to be it for today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Click the bell to join the notifications squad. Peace out.